Hey everybody. Welcome back for more Pokemon Mystery Dum. Ah! Too loud! Too loud. <laughs> Did not see that coming. Whoops. That was uh that was the wrong button entirely. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Welcome back for more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Explore the sky. I'm going to, uh... Well, uh, what I mean to say is, in the last episode, we got back to the present. Uh, which I mean the past. We went into Tree Shroud Forest, uh, recovered a time gear. Found out the time was already stopped in the area, despite the time already... Despite the time, Big Gear having been returned. And now we're going to do something completely different. Here comes Team Charm! <clears throat> One evening, there was a pixel on the right side of my... There was a column of pixels on the right side of my screen that was out of place. That's better. On the eastern horizon... In a small expanse of ruins. You know, now that I think about it, these guys are basically just giant stone no ponds. <laughs> this is this is the deepest part of the dungeon, I think. Ooh, hey, there's a treasure chest up there. Don't tell me. Don't tell me this isn't the treasure everyone's been blabbering about. It is, it has to be. This is the treasure of these ruins. Uh, I've been working hard as an explorer for a really long time. Finally, finally I found what I searched for. An awesome treasure. Ha 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 ha. This totally rocks, I can't wait. Oh darn, the moment I lift up this treasure, I'm afraid the ruins will start to crumble. But I thought of that. I was so excited I almost got careless. Anyway, I'll pick up the treasure carefully. Then I'll run as fast as I can out of here before it all crumbles down on me. Why don't you roll, Mr. Guy? It's no mistake. This treasure is. This treasure is mine. Wait a moment. What, what was that? That voice. This treasure has already been claimed. By us. We're not handing it over to you. Who's there? Who are you? Show yourself. <laughs> show yourself, you say? Alright, we'll show ourselves. Strength! Knowledge! Beauty! Here come the treasure hunters! Here comes Team Charm! What? Whoa! It's suddenly too dark to see! Ugh! The treasure's gone! Blast! I've been tricked! Them! I need to, uh, I need to set my microphone up right, actually. Clunk. Clunk. Oh! It's coming down! Oh no! Alright! That went well. Treasure of Ruins is ours. This was a pretty easy job, wasn't it? That's one victory right after another. That's right. We haven't lost out on a treasure we've aimed for yet. Not even one. Team Charm has a 100% success rate, and we take pride in that. Alright, let's go on and go undefeated. We're the treasure hunters, Team Charm. Among the three of us, there's nothing we can't do. Special Episode 4, here comes Team Charm. <laughs> the treasure hunters, Team Charm, are a very famous exploration team. They're not only famous for being master rank and having a great reputation, but also for their splendid ability to find treasure, which is admired by everyone. However, this story takes place a little earlier. It's the story that takes place before Team Charm became famous. The Team Charm that always gets the treasure they're aiming for. Their next target is... Wait, wait for me! We've, we've come pretty far. Are we anywhere near our destination yet? Just a little farther, Mindy. According to my research, once we get out of this jungle, 
Your destination is Boulder Quarry. Deep in Boulder Quarry, there's supposed to be a legendary treasure. It's said to be so beautiful that mere words cannot express it. Beautiful treasure. <laughs> Sounds like it'll fit us perfectly. Is, is that so? When I hear that, it makes me so very happy. Alright, let's do our best and get through this jungle. Um. Who are you? I'm Belle Awesome. I don't have a name for this character. I live in this jungle. If you're talking about the treasure in Boulder Quarry, you really should give up. What? Why? That treasure's been sought by many exploration groups, but so far nobody's found it. Everyone knows it's impossible to find. And lately, we, we th that is, those of us who live here think there might not actually be anything there to begin with. So don't you think you should give up as well? Uh, thank you, Bill Awesome. But we're not giving up. Well, that kind of treasure sounds exactly like the kind of thing we like to look for. We always find and acquire the treasure we're looking for. After all, we are the alluring treasure hunters. Team Charm! Hey, Sandy. Once you're prepared, let's head out. To the other side of the jungle. Alright! Sandy, Cindy, and Mindy of Team Charm. I could have named them after the Totally Spies characters, but I don't remember all their names. <laughs> oh well. Possible improbable. All right, let's take a look at our team. We've got a level thir Sandy, level 32 Lapunny. Uh, she can't use her held items, but she can uh, attract a uh, male Pokemon. Cindy the Gardevoir. Uh, very good special attack. Uh, very low defensive stats. Synchronize and Trace uh, are kind of interesting, I guess. Medi Mindy the Medicham. Again, high special attack, low defensive stats, so not nearly as low as uh, Cindy. Pure Power. Okay. Oop, can I check their moves? Yes. Alright, so Sandy has Pound, Mirror Coat, which uh, reflects special attacks. Jump kick and baton pass. What does baton? Whoops. No game. Come on. What does baton pass do in this context? Oh, okay. It shuffles the Pokemon around. That sounds like it'll just cause chaos. All right. Let's see. Cindy has Growl, Confusion, Wish, and Psychic. Wish, I believe, is, yeah, a healing move. Uh, no. It, uh, improved regen. Okay. Confusion and Psychic are both uh, special Psychic-type moves. Uh, why does why is Psychic... Oh, Psychic also reduces special defense by one level, and it only hits the enemy in front. Okay. Mindy gets Fire Punch, Hidden Power, Mind Reader, which, uh... Get, which uh, gives 100% accuracy for a while. And Force Palm. I don't know what uh, type Hidden Power is going to be. I guess we'll have to figure that out at some point. We don't have any items. Let's uh, check our storage. Whoops. Let's see, Team Olympia will not miss an apple or two, uh, nor will they miss a couple of orange berries. Two Reviver Seeds. I'll save that for uh, Team Olympia. One Max Elixir. One Escape Orb. Uh, let's see. Spurn Orb will be good if we uh, happen to run into a mystery dungeon. Uh, 
That's how we're gonna do this. Save the game. I really should know better than to do this, but I haven't had any uh, power issues in a while. Okay, so uh, this theme that you're hearing is from a uh, is from a friend zone in a Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team. A Drio, normal flying type. Sounds like a perfect excuse to uh, use jump kick. Moel is not a fairy type. She is pure steel. Which, of course, is why I'm using a normal type move. Uh, all things considered, we are a pretty high level. Uh, I'm not predicting any huge problems. Except maybe from a boss or two. This scenario actually has two bosses waiting for us. Iron Thorn. There's Jump Bluff. A, uh, well, I've already talked about Jump Bluff. This dungeon has ten floors. Let's just get on with it. Hey there, Moel. You sure do exist. Let's see if we can get Mindy in on the action. Whoops. We might not even need to, though. Yeah, get a look at that. to get Cindy to do something. Oh, well. oh yeah, fighting uh, type moves are apparently not very effective against the poison types. Which is a bit of an odd matchup, but whatever. Storms. It's probably from a hippopotamus on this floor somewhere. Hello, it's Fortress. Fortress is a bug steel type. I guess fighting is not very effective against bug either. You know, I think we are actually about due for uh, another Mystery Dungeon game now that Sword and Shield are finally out. I'm fine, really. If you're actually fine, uh, Cindy, stop using defensive moves. Oh jeez. This, uh, this might be bad news. I'm just gonna hope it's not. Double team, this is bad news. Get out of here. Get out of here, bird. I don't want your face. There's our culprit. Alright, everyone is pretty low on health, so we're just gonna head right on up to the next floor. There's a sandstorm here, too. 
can figure. Well, maybe if we're lucky, we can still uh, give ourselves some recovery before things get too crazy to handle. Of course, uh, watch a monster ship house show up right on cue. <laughs> Alright, it looks like we're safe here for now. Whoa! Alright, uh, Mindy, you deal with this. Thank you. Alright, you can, uh, you can stop using your moves. You can stop using ineffective moves, anyway. to uh, heal ourselves a little bit. Down a half belly already. Of course, I did uh, spend a lot of time just now uh, trying to heal myself. Which, as you know, uh, stalling for time in any roguelike means your food clock's gonna uh, drop like a stone. floors. What? Hypnosis? How rude. Somebody wake me up. Okay, we're good. That's not what I meant to do at all. I don't really need any of these. Final floor, and why is it snowing? Why is it snowing in the jungle? Oh no, poison powder! Shoot, this is bad. stairs. Real quick like. There we are. We made it! I think we reached the other side of the jungle. I'm pretty sure of it. Seems like we're out of southern jungle. So, Boulder Quarry is just ahead, right? some kind of strange noise coming from over there. You sure it's not just uh, somebody's stomach? Oh, it's wiggly tough. <laughs> By which I mean the uh, uh, Izzy. She's not moving. Not moving. Can't be. Uh-huh. Oh no, is she? But she's not moving at all. Oh no. Uh, S Sandy? Cindy? What do we do? What do we do? That sound again. We heard it come from over here. Is that from... Yeah, it looks like she just passed out from starvation. Mindy, uh, try giving her one of those. Got it. I'll put it down and see. Extraordinarily delicious perfect apple. 
Wow, a new face spray. This smell. It's delicious. It's a tiny bit sour, but of course sweet. This smell. I knew it! A perfect apple! <sighs> Thank you so much! It was really delicious! Thank you! I'm feeling better thanks to you! Perfect apples are my number one favorite food! You like perfect apples that much? Here, you can have mine too! Really? Thank you so much! Yay! We're the treasure hunters, King Charm. And you are? Yep, I'm Esmelda. I'm the first apprentice of the explorer, Jack Van Brace. Uh, Esmelda? Nice to meet you. I've never heard of the explorer, Jack Van Brace. But if you say you're an explorer's apprentice, uh, don't tell me you're also looking for a treasure in the quarry. It's no joke. We're the ones who are going to find that treasure. Treasure? What are you talking about? I was just taking a walk through here, that's all. And then suddenly all my food items were stolen by someone. I got really hungry and used up all my strength. And passed out here, that's all. Oh. Is that it? If that's it, that's Sun. She's such a strange explorer. Well, let's hurry on ahead. See you later, Izzy. Take care. Bye. Thanks again so much. Friendly friends. Yeah, I guess we can save. See you guys next time. <laughs> Short episode, but uh, yeah, the next dungeon is going to be just as long.